So we need to cut a lemon, light a candle, and we need lavender. Let's do this. Cut the lemon. <laughs> we cut it real fast. So we put that in there. Oh, lemon juice, nice. I need to stop around uh, two o'clock. That is uh, my cutoff time for today. It's an aroma lamp. Oh, I bet you it smells lovely. Lemon juice and lavender. Lovely lemon juice lavender lamp. Yeah, here, sniff on that. What happened? How did I get here? We've got to get away from that cursed ship. Goodbye, ship. Do you remember what happened here? And how you got to this ship? When I got home, I couldn't figure out how to destroy the compass. I was researching it, and the compass went missing. I think someone opened it, releasing its evil once again. Here's the key to my safe, where I stored the compass and my research. I was in the middle of deciphering my findings. Maybe you can finish the work. All right, I guess I'm gonna work on that While as well. you're looking for a way to destroy the compass, we'll find Grace. Oh, look at how we've got a new cool fancy boat over here. I like how the clouds are moving. This is neat. Okay, what does this, uh, what are we doing here? Without a map, I'll never find the island. Okay, cool, cool. Lavender is the best. It fixes everything. Heaven and hell, that's an interesting little sign over there. Ooh, hello, mermaid. Look at all this stuff here. Somebody needs to tidy up the mess. I like a cocktail that contains wine. Wine it is. Glug, 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 glug. <laughs> do we need to have a little umbrella and wine? That's typically not what you do with wine. Well, there must be something else I'm supposed to put in with this wine. Oh, some spritzer? Whatever they call it, sparkling something? That's probably a name. There's probably a name for that kind of drink. Sangria? Yeah, oh, okay, that could be it. But do you normally put one of those fancy umbrellas in that? I guess if you're on vacation, you would. <laughs> Why not? Uh, Bloody Mary, no, that's not a Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary is vodka and like tomato juice. Let's see, handprint. A fork and a couple roses. Sure, sure. Candy and a bullfighter. How about a kitty cat? So a fork, a rose, and a bell. Oh, there's the bell right there. Thank you, spirit. Oh, hi, dad. Live. All right, so we need a bull, full bull fighter and a rose, and there must be a clam somewhere. So we gotta. Oh, there we go. We can just grab in there. It could be sangria. I, I don't. I thought sangria was from Mexico, but I could be wrong. Where do we got? What do we see? Oh, that's our bull fighter. Okay, now we just need a rose. Where is the final rose? No roses in the flowers? That would be where you would think rose would be. And apparently it was in the flowers. There you go. And a glass cutter. Ah! Uh, <laughs> there it is. Got it. 
We now have a glass cutter. That's good, right? That's going to be helpful somehow. So we can cut this glass and see what's in here. Oh, hello. One of these kind of puzzles, apparently. Uh, hmm. Okay. Yeah, that is one complicated way to cut the glass. <laughs> Hello. Got to cut, cut, cut all over the place. Oh, I hear the clock. Oh, I saw you morphing there, mister. So what are we trying to put here? This is the perfect place to study. Ooh, that's a good place for Grace's photo. And now we have a stone hat. That's going to be for our pirate dude. Too dark to see anything. This grandfather clock is quite noisy. Uh, ooh, we got some glitter action over there, too. Oh, red wire. Interesting place for red wire. And a bird indentation. I wonder if this wing goes there. No. Huh. Yeah, I guess we are trying to be super careful with the design on that stained glass window. I can live with that. The, the gnome needs a chick red cap? Oh, chic? Okay. Let's see. Crab. Fishy, fishy. No need for kitty cat, apparently. A slice of bread, too. That looks like fresh bread. Ha ha ha! Love that! Hello, fish! Need a little statue here. Aww, it was hiding in the flower. Wow. What else do we have in here? Looks like we have a bow somewhere. And a rope. And I don't know what this thing over here is. Hmm. Oh, thank you. Yep, there's our bow. Excellent. Thank you for letting me go. Oh, thanks for stopping by, Jonathan. We'll see you next time. I have no idea. Oh, it's actually uh, paint. Okay. That works. And we now have some tape. Tape is good. Let's see. Let's go back here. Why do we need tape? Good question. Not exactly sure. Hmm. Oh, something over here. I'll fix the switch so I can turn on the light. Oh, I see. Wire it up, tape it up, and we're good to go. And this is going to go over here. Got myself a seagull and an eye. The key is needed. I think that's the key right there. Oh, you think there's still a collectible in here? Okay. I'll keep my eyes peeled. Put that on there, put that there, and then that goes there. A voice told the captain he'd be able to leave the island if he agreed to lure people here. It told him to build a machine and charge the compass, which would lead him home. Okay. The captain used the compass to return home. There he tried to destroy it. But no matter what he tried, it remained intact. So, he sealed it in a case. Interesting. We gotta decode the scrolls. I think that's where we're gonna put here. 
The scroll is charmed. I need to find the way to the island. Uh, not exactly sure what I need to put in there. Nope. Yeah, no, I, we've gotten all the collectibles because we got the achievement for all the collectibles. Let's see. I guess there's no collectibles here and here. I guess is kind of the story behind that. Uh, oh yeah, the bird has to go here. Hello, birdie. And that's going to help us up here, I'm fairly certain. Up there. And it's Only a puzzle. Only the symbol of hope will destroy the demon, but the symbol's hidden on an island somewhere. This is it! A map of the island where I'll find the symbol of hope. Okay, we'll do this. Uh, let's see. Wait a minute. Oh, we're just rotating them. Okay, I thought we were trying to move them around. We did it! We found the map! We now have the map so we can go on the boat. Let's go ahead and... Oh! Little, uh... Clicky clicky here first. Apple. We're gonna try and put together some sort of uh, fruit plate. No need for the ladybug. What other fruits do we need? Oh, it's a butterfly. Swordfish. Hmm. Still need one more piece of fruit. Click, 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 click. Swordfish and a wind chime. And a candle, too. Oh, still missing a piece of fruit. Oh, that was a banana, was it? <laughs> I had no idea. Okay, now we have this. And we're good. And now we need a ship's wheel. I suppose that was something we needed, was it? I don't know if these old boats have wheels like that, do they? I guess they do. Not this island again. But I can't let that distract me. I've got to find the symbol of hope. We've got to find the symbol of hope. I can cut the rope with something sharp. I don't think I have anything sharp. I don't think that'll go there, no. Oh, it's gonna go there though. I don't want to be led by this demon. I cannot sacrifice other people's lives. I will find a way to outwit him. Found an amulet of protection. This amulet will help to neutralize the demon's charms for a time. For a time, you say. Morphing object. Wow, I'm missing four of them. Darn. Where are we? We're like inside the beast of some animal or something. What's with all these spines everywhere? Interesting. Find all the parts. Uh, okay. Oh, I see. There we go. Yeah, no, this is, uh, it's been good. Like, considering that I wasn't really planning today, I'm happy that we had a good 20 people watching today. That's actually fun. I greatly appreciate that. So what is this over here? I gotta figure out how to cut that. Um, no, we don't have the ability to do that yet. Let's go to the hidden cave. Ooh. I'd better not go into the water. I must find another way. Piece is missing. Oh, looks like we're gonna need one more. Okay, let's see. 
That wing will go there. Looks like we're going to need a, a lever that goes there. So let's back up here and we'll put that flower back over here. Okay, so we need that. I assume we're going to have a matching game over here. Let's try and see. Put that there. Oh, maybe not. Restore the picture by opening all the mural pieces. One of these kind of things, is it? Oh boy. Uh, yeah, there we go. 27 out of 28. Wow. Whatever I'm doing, I'm doing good. I like the sound in the background. It makes me think of a horror game. Ooh. We have to abandon this place, our former home. We sacrificed everything to save the world from the evil, and now this island became a place of its imprisonment. So we got ourselves a crystal. So, how does that help me? Don't know. What does our map say? Well, looks like we're supposed to be back here. Okay. So where does this crystal have to go? Oh, it probably goes right there. Ooh. There's our lever we've been looking for. Put that on there and let's see what happens. <laughs> nice. Very dramatic. <laughs> what makes you think you can stop me? I've been in prison far too long to let you get in my way. Okay, she's got some blue flame action going on here. I must neutralize Grace, at least for a time. What can I use to do this? I don't know. Give me a bit of protection. I think we kind of saved her. Now I can use the symbol of hope to banish the demon. Well, we don't have it yet. But I have a sharp stone. We got half of that. Alright, let's go back here. I think the other half of the amulet was hanging up here. Cut that down. And uh, we'll take it. Let's go back and get the other half of that put on here. And now we're ready to rock and roll with this fancy compass. Ooh, we need to banish the demon. Exorcist, there's the last achievement. and a strange voice. You were possessed by the demon jailed here on this island. But it can't hurt you, or anyone else, ever again. Thank you, Emma. At last, my family is free from that cursed compass. We're safe now. Alright, that is going to be the end of the game. Uh, that was pretty cool. I actually enjoyed that bonus chapter. That was a lot of fun. Uh, for those of you folks that are new, don't forget to hit that follow button, and I will be live streaming again tomorrow at 1 o'clock Toronto time. Thanks for hanging out with me with this super surprise uh, sneaky live stream. This is Friday, so hopefully you all have a great Friday, and uh, I will see you all tomorrow. Thanks everyone. Bye for now.